Okay, super fast and just in time. I personally hate flimsy lacy garlands in pink and white, but bare walls aren't very romantic, right? Also, I'm a big fan of darker art anyway, so I came up with this notion instead. These heart strings are crazy inexpensive, under $3, and you can make a ton of them. In all, I think I've gotten about 15 strings so far, and I haven't used up half the paper yet. Ingredients. Poster board in black and red, or what other colors you choose. Yarn in the same or contrasting color. Multiple heart shapes in different sizes. Scissors, a hole punch, pencil, a hairpin, or large needle for threading. Action. Traced out several sizes of hearts. I chose three different sizes for each color. Punch holes randomly into the hearts. I usually do two or three, but you can see how it goes for you. Cut a length of thread that's about 18 inches, but no longer. You'll usually have extra yarn as opposed to not a knot. Loop a knot at one end of the yarn and slide the other end into your needle. Thread the yarn into one of the holes on your top heart. Then repeat the motion through the same hole so it doubles up. Thread the yarn into the next hole, then a second time, and that's your first heart. Leave about an inch or two inches of space and thread the next heart, and so on, and so forth. You can see that different hole placements make the threading unique. And when you get to your last heart, knot the yarn so that it won't slip and snip off the excess. You can hang these from window balances, doorways, ceilings, anywhere. Even write on them and make a whimsical personal valentine. It's a great kids project for little fingers and rainy days, and you can change up the shapes and colors for other events. Hope I saved you some cash, darlings. Who loves you, baby? Special request, 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 special request,